Hi guys, this is Chandika. Welcome to learning under of C language. In this tutorial, we are going to discuss about preprocessing if conditional statement in C language. Like we discussed in previous tutorial classes, if conditional statement. Similarly, the C compiler has a feature like as if conditional statement and as end if conditional statement. This as if is referred as a preprocessive conditional statement in C language. Before this if conditional statement and else if conditional statement are come to a picture, these as if conditional statements and end if conditional statements are used widely in C programming language. Now let's see in syntax for the as if conditional statement. Here we have to use as if uh, command and this small space tab and then the condition we have to specify here. This is the syntax for the if as if conditional statement similarly as end if as as an the as preprocessed directive followed by end if conditional statement Let's see working often is as if conditional statement with a small example here i am returning as if conditional statement because i pass in the condition as true and then i am printing in tendle car in the output screen let's see an output Here we are getting 10 layer in the output screen. Now let me discuss uh, how it's working. Actually, in a half if conditional statement, there is no logic like blocks. So if you are trying to declare any blocks in within this if as if conditional statement, then the compiler is going to throw sorry. Just the compiler will throw this 10 car in the output screen. Here we are getting 10 in the output screen. Actually, how it's work in the sense this as if condition statements treat like this if condition has a as an impact in between the statement that we are written before this end if condition statement. Here I am using a three printf statement in this as if condition statement. First printf statements will print a tendle car, next printf statement print say hello and third print of statement print hi let's see in output we are getting three in the output screen if suppose i am declaring it as an false false condition then we are not going to get any output in the output screen by this we can get a conclusion that the if as if condition statement as an impact the statements that were written in between this as if condition statement and end if condition statement. If suppose we are trying to use this as if condition statement without an ending and this condition as end can as end if conditions, then the compiler will throw an error. It is an in infinite conditional um, block of execution. While using this as if condition statement, it should be terminated with the as end if condition statement similar to else if condition statement we here we are here there is an another uh, pre uh, condition uh, statement that is elif this elif uh, act like similar to else if condition so here i am using an as if condition statement with true condition and i am printing the three print of statements under then i am declaring an as elif statement with a false condition i am printing trying to print false in the output screen now let's see an output we are getting tendlegar hello hi so suppose i am declaring false in the false in the if condition statement and i am declaring true so now let's see output here we are getting also in the output screen. So by this we can have a uh, conclusion that as if statements will uh, have an impact on first three in print of statements and then it loses its power when it reading the as elif condition statement. Now we as elif has an impact on the below print of statements. Here I am using two print of statements in the uh, elif condition statement. The first print of statement with a wasu and second print of statement with a screen wasu. Let's see now output. We are getting them both in the output screen wasu and screen wasu. 
is by because the as elif statement also has a power to uh, methods that we are written within this uh, as elif statement and the end if statement this pre processed pre con uh, if condition statement also there is, we can use a nested if condition statements here i am using first as if statement and then followed by elif statement and then followed by elif statement so let's see now there is no compilation error so we are getting versus inverse in the output screen because among these three if conditional statements only the second one is true by this we can have an idea that we can use an nested if conditional statement by preprocessed directly conditional statement in c language now let's see what happen if the two conditional statements are true let's compile it we are getting only tinker hello hi in the output screen as i explained in the previous tutorial the same uh, principles is used in this if can as if conditional statement also once the compiler uh, identify that any one conditional statement is true then it's automatically uh, assumes that the remaining condition statements are false so it won't it won't it won't execute the remaining uh, condition statement whether it is a true or false condition so the first condition statement that it appears from the top to bottom the uh, that will be executed and remaining condition statements will be quitted off now let's see what happen if suppose i am using semicolon in the if as if condition statement itself let compile it here they are showing an error this is why because the as if condition statement won't allow and termination in itself in this line itself because it should have an at least one um, statement to be executed let's see what happen if you are using an this termination uh, semicolon in this else if condition statement let compile it so the compiler throws an error same principle is used for this else if condition statement also it is won't allow a semicolon in this same line itself you should have at least one execution come a statement let's see it is possible to declare an inner if condition statement here i am first time declaring an outer if as if condition statement and then the inner if as if condition statement let it compile it and execute so here we are getting an error that unterminated as if condition statement this is why because the first as if statement should be terminated before and starting an second as if condition statement so this compiler won't execute an as if statement without any ending option so by this we can have a conclusion that in as if condition statement there is no inner conditional statement is allowed for this drawback the if condition statement and else if condition statements are introduced in c language similar to if condition statement as if condition statement also allow an data type as a condition if suppose i am given one then it's treat it is a true condition it is going to display general car allow high in the output screen if suppose i am using zero then let's see now We are getting Vasu and Srinivasu. Now this is why because while we are giving zero to the if condition statement, treat it as a false condition. Similarly, it allows a negative data type also. So this negative data type treat it as a true condition. So by this you can have a conclusion that the zero is treated as a false. Other than zero, all the values are treated as true. The, the fact factorial values also boolean sorry float values are is not uh, accepted in this if as if condition statement similar to an uh, if condition statement characters are also allowed in, in as if condition statement we are getting an output true uh, tenilka hell hello and hi the only difference between the this as if condition statement and if condition statement is it won't allow an float value float value as an conditional condition statement we are getting an error 
The another difference between the if condition statement and as if condition statement is if suppose we are trying to give a character without a single quote, then this as if statement treat it is a false condition statement and it's going to execute an next true condition statement. I hope by this you can an idea you got an idea about in this as if condition statements and as if nested condition statements. So Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe to get an alert for the next tutorial classes.